6 a.m., the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is looking into a possible link between reports of a type of heart inflammation and people who received mRNA COVID-19 vaccines. That's either Pfizer or Moderna. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie spoke to the Rhode Island Department of Health about this, and we wanted to know, are there any cases being investigated in Rhode Island? Yeah, so Dr. Philip Chan told me the health department is looking into one confirmed case of the condition known as myocarditis in an adult, in an adult patient who had received one of the mRNA vaccines. He tells me that patient was hospitalized for a day and is doing fine. Uh, the CDC says reports of myocarditis were predominantly presenting in adolescents and young adults, more often in males than females and typically after the second dose and about four days later. The agency also says most cases appear to be mild and follow-ups are ongoing. Dr. Chan says symptoms generally include chest pain, trouble breathing, or irregular heartbeat. And while serious complications can occur, most people do well. He says it may be difficult to figure out if COVID vaccines are causing the inflammation because the condition is usually caused by a viral infection, including those that can cause the common cold, flu, and COVID-19. We're actually in the time of the year that we tend to actually see more cases of myocarditis in the hospital because we're seeing other viral infections that cause this. It's very uncommon, very rare, but it does happen. And we're in the time of year, in fact, I was talking to one of my pediatric cardiologists who said that it's myocarditis season in general. And Dr. Chan tells me the health department is looking into other suspected cases, but all of those patients are doing well and were not hospitalized. The CDC is continuing to monitor the situation. I'm Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.